back on the channel with another video and today we're gonna do a few tips and tricks for some common problems that you may have at some point with your device and today we got Samsung Galaxy A52 S 5G quite a strong and powerful device with very good specification and a good price so today i'm going to show you a few tips and tricks that i've done on all of my devices at some point some of them did work some of them didn't work so it depends now on your device so today we're just going to start with uh, let's say one common problem for all of these uh, devices the battery which in some cases is draining quite quick but uh, it may fix uh, with some of these tips and I do this on all of my devices not only on Samsung so uh, this model is coming with 4500 million per battery and fast charging and 22 watts so what I'm doing on all of my devices is to do this well if you don't use location if you don't use NFC Bluetooth and uh, what else you got over here dark mode well you just have to deactivate some of them and activate the other ones for example i don't use location at the moment only when i'm driving so it's no point to have it on also nfc i'm not gonna pay anything in the house so just gonna deactivate nfc bluetooth is the same i don't send any files so i'm gonna deactivate it Wi-Fi, well I don't use it at the moment, I only use the mobile data so I'm just gonna leave mobile data Also for hotspot, you may have hotspot activated So I usually deactivate the hotspot unless I use it And the last one would be to activate the dark mode Which is gonna make the phone totally dark And all these tips would may help the battery to be a bit more longer to last a bit more so I'm using these tips on all of my phones not only on this one and um, well you may find a difference on the battery life the next tip would be for network problems network settings Wi-Fi is not working data is not working Bluetooth is not working so what I'm doing on all of my devices it's uh, one simple uh, trick is just to activate the flight mode which at the moment is gonna disconnect Bluetooth, Wi-Fi and uh, data and is not gonna have access to any of them as you can see you got this airplane uh, on a corner so it's no signal which um, it may be fixed if you deactivate flight mode it's gonna come back to the network data would be back it's gonna try to find signal so it may fix this problem with um, the network after all of this is still not working what you can do is just um, let me show you from the beginning swipe down go on uh, settings and then you can type over here general management or reset and on here on reset you go to reset all settings, reset network settings and reset accessibility settings. You just have to choose reset network settings and once you type on the reset settings it's going to reset all the Wi-Fi, mobile data and Bluetooth. So this may fix your problem with the network problems. Also if that first solution doesn't fix the issue with the networks or it doesn't fix any other issues you can always do a factory reset for your device and how to do that is just swipe down go back on settings right here type in reset go back on reset again reset and then you got factory data reset and this would set up uh, your device like it was made from factory it's gonna erase all your data including files and downloaded apps also this may fix um, all your problem in case uh, with that um, network problems or other problems let's say when your phone is a bit laggy you feel that you need to give a full restart full reset and you're gonna have a fresh new let's say not device but a fresh new start Another tip would be for the heating problems on your device, especially not on this one, but on any other device. 
Well, and some of the tips would be these ones. While charging the phone, you can try to remove the case. As you can see, I got the case. And uh, you may try this tip to release that heat to go. Also, try to not uh, play games while charging your phone. And uh, maybe don't use the phone too much because it will overheat and the charging would be very slow. Also, always charge your Samsung Galaxy A52s 5G, at least on this case, with the original charger only. Also, the heating problems are also caused by playing games for a long time on your device, especially when it's on charge and you want to play more. And also, uh, always keep your device updated and keep updating all your apps and uh, to do that, especially for the apps, you just have to go on uh, Play Store, as you can see here, Manage Apps and Updates Available, 19 updates pending, so you just have to tap and update all of them. Also, if you're looking for software updates, always go on Software Update, Download and Install, Checking for Updates, as you can see, nothing at the moment, but also today I just installed another update for this Samsung Galaxy A52s 5G after the previous one with the RAM Plus feature and camera improvements. And this one is bringing um, more security. The security of your device has been improved. As you can see, security patch level 1st of September with a size of 183 megabytes. So this is the last update which was successfully installed and these are some of the tips that you can do for the heating problem. Now tips for apps opening slowly on your device. Well, what you can do? Well, always check if you got enough um, memory on your device and you can check that on storage as you can see right here 49 gigabytes left of 128 gigabytes also you can always use going on um, play store always you can use um, the light apps of the main application like facebook twitter youtube so you can always type um, facebook light so you can download the light version of Facebook, which may work a bit faster on your device. Well, this model Facebook is working quite fast. It's enough power to run all the apps and games, so I wouldn't make any problem related. But for other phones, well, you may use this light application, which reduce more RAM usage on your device. Also, if all these um, tips is not working, you can do again, like I said uh, previous, a reset, going on the reset options and you can do a factory data reset. Just tap on the factory and you're gonna reset your device and you're gonna have a fresh start. What if uh, your device unexpectedly shutting down? Well, this problem is common because it um, occurs in all Android phones. Well, if you're facing this type of problem on your device, then uh, definitely consider the steps. Well, some of the solution steps would be if the temperature of the phone rises to the maximum level, then it can also be the reason for the sudden shutdown of your phone so take care of the heating issue like i previously said before do not use a heavy back cover as this may cause heating problems and following all these steps if you feel that your phone is still a sudden shutdown then you can try uh, the factory reset like i showed you previously for fixing other problems well i hope all these steps will solve the sudden shutdown issue on your device but if this still uh, continue well, uh, you may think to go on a service center and resolve it. Also, what's happened if uh, your device screen frozen or been stuck? You may face this problem while doing a task, playing a game or making a phone call. Well, you can do the following steps. Update the phone to the latest OS available. As you can see, my phone is uh, already updated to the latest one, so no problem. 
simply uninstall and force start the app you don't use. Also, if you experience this problem while using an app, then you can go to the settings and then you can go on apps and here on apps, let's say you choose the app that is not working, you can tap it and you can go on storage and here on storage, you can clean uh, the clear data and the clear cache. So you just tap on it, tap on this. Also, if you tap on this one, the data will be deleted permanently. This including all file setting accounts and database. So once you touch on clear data and then you're gonna reopen this app, you're gonna have to put again your account, but this may fix the problem um, of being stuck, being frozen. So also not being able to use it. Also, if this is still not working, you can always perform a factory reset and this can solve uh, all your problems. Next would be some problems with the camera of your device and maybe it's time to do a reset for the camera. Resetting the camera means to clear its cache and data of the camera. If this is an app problem, then uh, this procedure will be able to fix it. And don't worry, your pictures and videos will not be deleted if you do this. All you have to do to reset your camera is just to tap and hold on the camera, as you can see right here. Then you got this info right here, which is gonna take you on this little menu. And then you can go on storage, and then you can do the same thing like previous with the apps, clear the cache, and we're gonna do it because nothing gonna happen. And then I'm just gonna take you back on the camera. And uh, yeah, that's it, it's working, no problem. And it may fix also uh, the problem, let's say when it's stuck and it's not working and uh, after doing this the camera application and uh, see if the problem still occurs if it does then uh, move to the next solution which is factory reset again as you can see this factory reset may fix most of the common problems that you may have on your device and probably the last uh, tip and trick or let's say a common problem that you may have on your device apps that not downloading from the play store and not only on this device but probably on some other devices this may be a problem. Sometimes this problem is due to the new update of the Play Store. But let's say if you got this problem and the apps doesn't download, you can do these uh, steps. First of all, would be to reset your device. Tap in on this one right here. Tap on reset one more time. And you're gonna have a fresh start, which can fix the problem with the apps that are not downloading. Then you can clear the Play Store local search history by going on Play Store, going and tap on this icon, going on settings right here, go on general, and on general you just have to tap on account and device preferences. And here on preferences you got clear device search history, clear wish list, and so on. So you just have to tap on clear device um, search history and all searches that you've made into the play which will be removed and you just have to clear history and the search history it's all cleared and at this point um, the apps that not downloaded may be fixed and it may work so these are just a few tips and tricks for the common problems that you may have at some point with your device. Today we got this example of um, beautiful and powerful Galaxy A52 S 5G. I didn't have any problem at all with this device till this moment. No heating problem, no apps that not downloaded, no network problems and so on. But these are only some of the tips, tricks and common problems that you may have uh, on your device at some point and I did had uh, let's say only problems with the heating and with the networks so um, I did some of these tips and actually did work especially for the network problems but some of these tips may not work so uh, just um, take it like that well I hope you enjoyed this video if you want to do even more these tips and tricks 
for common problems just uh, let me know into the comments being said thank you for watching this video give it a like share subscribe and see you soon with another interesting one